Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today, we're tackling a question that many Visual Studio users encounter. Our viewer is experiencing some unusual debugging behaviors in Visual Studio 2015 community and wants to know how to reset the debugging options back to their default settings. Let's dive into the details and find a solution together. Welcome back to another technical video. Today we're going to be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy like me, and hopefully you get to that resolution. Now, let's continue on. To reset the debugging options in Visual Studio 2015 Community, we will start by accessing the Options menu. Click on the Tools menu at the top of the window. In the Options dialog, look for the Debugging section on the left sidebar. This is where you can find various debugging settings. To reset all debugging options to their defaults, click on the General subcategory under Debugging. Here, you will see a button labeled Reset All Settings. After clicking Reset All Settings, a prompt will appear asking if you want to proceed. Confirm your choice to reset the settings. Finally, to reset Exception Settings, go to Debug in the top menu, select Windows, and then Exception Settings. You can manually reset these as needed. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To reset Visual Studio debugging options to default, start by launching Visual Studio 2017. Then, go to the Tools menu and select Import and Export Settings. Choose the Reset All Settings option and click Next. If you want to overwrite your current settings, select No, just Reset Settings. Finally, choose General or the specific settings you want to restore and click Finish. And that's it guys. I hope you found the answer that you're looking for and got to that resolution in the end. If you did, please take a moment, hit subscribe. I really appreciate it. Until the next time you need more technical videos, I hope you have a great day. Cheers.